did you know that the world's most expensive cheese sandwich costs 110 pounds? It's like 140 bucks. Created by Welsh chef Martin Venos, the sandwich is made from sourdough bread dressed with extra virgin olive oil, layered cheddar cheese, sliced quail eggs, heirloom black tomatoes, epicure apples, and fresh figs. The whole thing is topped off with pea shoots, red amaranth, and of course, a coating of edible gold dust. You gotta love it. And do you know, hey, hey, do you know one thing my Indian friends do is they put on their biryani gold, uh, gold uh, flakes as well. It's considered, really? yeah, it's a good luck thing. So anyway, speaking of good luck and good, and we love the guy, ladies and gentlemen, Chef Warren Berman of Great Temptations Catering. Chef Warren, how you doing? Very well, how are you? Good Great. stuff, man. And uh, nice, to meet nice to meet you too. Sonia Chin, the lovely Sonia Chin. Now, <laughs> you get spoiled today. Yeah, oh, she good. really is I because uh, you are making one of my favorite things, and anyone who's connected to me on Twitter will know I actually put foie gras lover. Well, I know I know your passion for foie gras. So foie what we're going to do today is combine a lot of different flavors and a lot of different textures. So I'm going to sear some foie gras. Mm -hmm. We're going to top it with a little black bean chili with butternut squash, mm. smoky bacon, which will complement the fattiness of the foie gras. And then when you do foie gras, you want to have a touch of acid. So mm -hmm. we're going to have some pomegranate balsamic. Mm. A little truffle oil, because I know you hate that. Uh. And then we're going to do a uh, julienne and a confit of uh, hearts of palm and artichoke hearts. Oh, oh. man. So mm. we got our pan heating up here, so I'm going to get the bacon started. So you know what? We have to talk yet. Hey, man, how can I not love you for putting bacon shallots together, and then we're going to have something that is another 100% fat. That is foie gras. Well, you know, it's, it's a heart attack on a plate. We have to. <laughs> yes, you know what? Some, it, it just, it's all about, you know, in just, I just want you to live long enough to pay the bill. Exactly. You know? So we're going to put this in and we're going to yep. uh, we'll turn this up a little. So, mm -hmm. Chef Berman, you got to tell us, what's going on in the world of Great Temptations Catering? What are you up to lately? Well, I'm busy with catering and I've just accepted a contract in Oakville to uh, open an upscale re restaurant called Bravo. Okay. So we're going to go sort of uh, smaller portions, encourage people to have wine pairings. Right. Um, Oakville's definitely conducive to that sure. sort of marketplace. Sure. And then the Wedding Savior project that I was involved in last right. fall, right. they want to expand nationwide. So we're going to start going into different communities right on. and start getting other communities involved with providing weddings for less fortunate people. Yeah, oh, and you've nice. done that in the past, and like it's been really, we, really successful. We had a huge, huge response, and uh, on Facebook she had over 100,000 hits, and wow. she's just... Wow! Yeah. 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 So things are... Uh, going well for her and uh, I want to stay involved with the project. Absolutely. Um, so for people who don't know, foie gras, we can't have goose liver in Canada. Mm -hmm. uh, this is our national bird. So we right. have duck. Mm -hmm. Okay. So what they do is they treat the ducks very well and then we have the liver. Now the foie gras is not like any other kind of liver. Mm -hmm. It's high fat and it doesn't have that strong calves liver taste. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, hearts of palm if you've yes, never had. Never had it. They're uh, indigenous to Costa Rica, mm -hmm. and they are actually the center of a palm tree. Oh. And they're absolutely phenomenal. Unfortunately, mm -hmm. you can't get fresh up here. It's very difficult. They're mm -hmm. canned, right? Yeah. Okay. But they're still really, really delicious. Mm -hmm. Is mm -hmm. that sweet? Is it, um, or is it kind of bland? Or what kind of... Oh, I can... Yeah, of well, course. There you go. Good Christian, stuff. Christian, I mean, Christian tastes all the mm. time. Oh, this is nice. Yeah. Yeah, I love it. So Beautiful we'll, stuff. Now, now, tell everybody to... Uh, again, about the foie gras, people are always like wondering, where can I get foie gras? I mean, obviously, before you came on today, you the, you had the whole lobe, which was the whole entire liver. Mm -hmm. um, it is a little, it, it's very, very pricey. Um, oh, man, what is it? It's like $25 a pound or something like Easily. that. Easily. Unbelievable. And there's different right? grades, too. Yeah. Um, and, I mean, a place like uh, Mark McHugh and I carried it when I had the store. Yeah. Um, High-end butchers would carry it. Right. Um, but it's not something that's very common. And a lot of people aren't going to buy it because you can't. It's difficult to handle unless mm -hmm. you know how to devein it and everything. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, so. You can also buy just, uh, like, single portions of foie gras. Yes, they now have them. Uh, I know yeah. a, guy, a guy I met in Chicago who was repping someone in Quebec yeah. was doing that. They were slicing it and mm -hmm. freezing it. Yep. And then they made it more uh, home friendly, I guess, for and lack of a better word. And okay. they're still about fifteen dollars a piece. Right? Oh yeah, at that, at that, and they're not even very big. Now the trick to this stuff too is you don't cook it very long because otherwise it'll disintegrate it's on you. Fat. Oh really? Okay. Right. So we're gonna season it with some uh, fine uh, celery. Celery from Guérande. Yes, sir. Love it. Absolutely great. 
crust. Now the other thing that you have to get used to, I guess, when you do, uh, it, it's high heat in the pan sometimes with the duck, but also it, it, the the smoke that comes off of it is very, oh, yeah. very, yeah. Yeah. If you're doing don't it home, stand above it. No, and you'd better have your fans on at home yeah. because, oh, really? yeah, it is very, uh, you'll see when we yeah. get it going it, here. Okay. Yeah. Um, so we're going to put a splash of balsamic vinegar in this. Oh. Oh, that looks great. I like a little splash of balsamic wherever I go. It's my new cologne, <laughs> kids. Love it. And oh, and don't laugh. It's true. Yeah, it's true. I'm yeah. <laughs> so now these knives are different from the ones I normally bring on the show. Yep. These are global knives, and yep. they're Japanese, mm -hmm. and they're all one piece, and they're like a scalpel. They're great knives. Okay. But they're also, like that knife is $150. Yeah. So they're not mm -hmm. cheap. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So we got our chili going here. Yeah. And then we're going to drop... Oh. So okay, you remember I had, this, I is a, this, stuff. this is a, this is a, a bal mousse, what they call it. So they've taken uh, balsamic vinegar mm -hmm. and infused it with different flavors. So we've, infused, this one's infused with truffles, because I brought and it's, it. And it's a Bianco okay. too, so yeah. it's a white. It's fantastic. So it's got a very intense flavor, but here, try a little. Try that, Thank that you. is gold. Of course I won't forget my buddy here. No, no, you know I'm down with this stuff, mm, seriously. It's nice. Isn't that nice? Yeah, it's very nice. Beautiful. Mm. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And then we're also going to, I've made a tomato and a onion confit. So we've taken uh, Roma tomatoes mm -hmm. and onions and cooked and cooked and cooked and cooked them down. Mm -hmm. So we have a nice sweet thing to it. Okay. Beautiful. So we have about three minutes, Chef Berman. Okay. Thank you. Sweet. Oops, sorry. Thank you. Love it. In goes the fucking mm, Nice. Mm. Mm. Chef Berman, okay. if you were on a desert island, you could only eat one thing, what would it be? If you had one, if this was like, or, or as I always say, okay, okay. Let's say as I always interview my favorite chefs and I say, you're on death row. I mean, you're a chef, there's, <laughs> come on, could happen. Okay, get in trouble what are you, somewhere. What are you, what are you trying to say? Well, no, you know, any, any chef, you're on death row, final meal, come okay. on. Someone could ask me that. Death row, final meal. I would, would I would have uh, definitely a lobster thermidor stuffed with foie gras like the one we made on the show. Oh, Ooh. that was unbelievable. I mean, lobster mm. stuffed with foie gras. And come on, now, cholesterol central, gotta exactly. love it. Exactly. Now I've also done Chilean sea bass yep. and butterflied it, stuffed lobes of foie gras in it with a wow. rose petal uh, confit and mm. baked it. Just a little wow. champagne vinaigrette. Awesome. Wow. Wow. Well, that looks like, that's looking really good there. Sorry? It's looking really good. Oh, yeah. There. Unbelievable. And what, you, what the beauty is, which I'm going to show you in a second, is mm. this fat mm -hmm. is gold. So you can either dip bread in it, but what I'm going to do is going to toss the artichokes <laughs> and, <they're>, oh. and the. <laughs> oh. So mm. I love my job. <laughs> Sorry, I was gonna say that. Wow, see, it doesn't take very long, yeah, does it? Yeah, you were joking. Yeah, yeah. No. unbelievable. So we're gonna do that. Let's throw this in quickly. And this isn't for the faint of heart. <laughs> it's true. You know, no, seriously. <laughs> but you know what? Honestly, if it was legal for me to roll around in that duck fat, I just might, folks. <laughs> I know they're laughing in the control room, but I might. Okay? I know it's a bad visual. Lots of bad visuals. It's a today. very bad visual. Earlier with you in the bathroom. My wife always when I come home and she says, you know, I'm glad I didn't and I say no, what I said on the show, and she goes, I'm glad I didn't see that. <laughs> I hope. None I can't wait to meet your that. wife one day. Oh, she must be a strong woman. Yeah, well, she, yeah, I don't think so. <laughs> she, uh, she has her issues. <laughs> Look at nice. that. So what we're gonna do is uh, just a little. Tom Hart's beautiful. A little drizzle. I'm gonna cut up a little piece. A little of bit of bread. Mm -hmm. Oh, Chef Berman, you're you're serious. You know what? Uh, this is good. Looking good, folks. Nice. It's not about the steak, it's a sizzle, right, buddy? That's right, my friend. You got it. And we're gonna top it with a little of this compote. The compote on top here? Mm -hmm. Oh, this is like a treat. This is more than a That's treat. It's lovely. And there we go. Well, folks, you, if you want more information about <gasps> Chef Warren Berman, you can go to rogerstv.com slash daytime Durham. There'll be some more information there about our good friend. And look at that, amazing. I, I'm you don't get to touch, you get, you, get, you get this later. Go ahead, but we mm. just gotta round it up, but we'll be trying this right after the break. Mm -hmm. And after the break, we'll also be drawing for the prize of the That's week. Right. It'll keep you clean, and we're gonna be trying the foie gras right after the break. Chef Warren, Chef Warren Berman in oh, very quickly. Right. He's gonna bring in our foie gras. Mm -hmm. That's all good, that was Chewbacca again. Chewbacca. Ah, Chef Berman, oh, look at this. Oh, that looks Try great. Try this, this is fun. Have you ever had foie gras before? Never, Tell never. me, be honest, are you freaked out? You're about to eat a duck liver. Okay. 100% duck liver. Okay. Mm. Come on, everybody. They, Sonia Chan, Sonia, get into the duck mm. liver here, come on. Baby steps. They're mm. baby steps. 
<laughs> this is how it's done, folks. Remember, I remember Ooh. when the, the ex-TV wife was still here. She used to get freaked out about this, but not this guy. See this? You've never been shy. I remember you attacked that uh, lamb shank pretty aggressively. Mm, mm -hmm. I've just had my fat content for a month. <laughs> wow. This is delicious. Unbelievable. Yeah. Unbelievable. Well Chef Berman, great Thank job. You. Thank you very Pleasure much. Pleasure meeting you. Welcome. See you again soon. You. Thank you so much. Anyway.